It is rush hour in this city and thousands of people are catching their trains and buses home at this hour. But there is some concern tonight because commuting in the city may be getting more expensive. In its 2019 budget, the TTC has proposed a 10 cent fare increase. This would be the eighth fare hike in the past decade and some advocates say enough is enough. This is a slap in our face. Um, it's a working poor community that's going to be impacted the most. Their fight for cheaper TTC fares just took a huge step back. The Jane Finch action against poverty has been making noise about the cost of using this public service for years. But in its 2019 budget, the TTC just proposed a 10 cent fare hike. It's a lot when we're talking about a working poor community. It's a lot when uh, transportation is going up, food is going up, rent is going up, additional cost of uh, hydro. Uh, people are on fixed income in our neighborhood. People are working precarious work in my neighborhood. Um, Ten cents does make a difference. The TTC estimates the increase will generate an additional $25 million in passenger revenues. The money will be used to help balance the 2019 budget, but won't go towards any future services improvements, it will only be used to maintain existing services. Nobody wants to do a fare increase. It's not something that we, we love to do. We recognize they're not very popular. But we, you know, had we're faced with a, a budget shortfall and budget pressures. The TTC tells us improvements made in the last few years need to be preserved. Kids ride free, two-hour transfers, extra trains and capacity improvements on Line 1, as well as an expanded express bus network are just some of the enhancements the extra revenue will help maintain. We do have to uh, ask the city for an increase in subsidy, but again, you know, we want to keep that as, uh, as low as we possibly can. The TTC is among the least subsidized transit systems in North America. 63% of their revenue comes directly from the fare box, about 32% from the city. The last hike was 10 cents in 2017. We looked at everything and we are, you know, having to make tough decisions uh, in areas that don't impact service because we're not willing to impact service at this point. Not impressive by it. Like, everyone pays, like, way too much, like, these days. It's unfortunate, but, I mean, I understand why there are reasons behind it. If it goes up constantly, obviously it's a bit of an annoyance, but if you take an Uber, take a taxi, it's still far more expensive. The proposed 10 cent increase applies across the board, with the exception of the adult cash fare. That will remain at $3.25, but Presto and token fares will go up to $3.10. If Toronto City Council approves this proposal, it will take effect April 1st.